Hello everybody, welcome back to Elden Ring. In this one we are going to be clearing the uh, Albinoric Rise. This place has the Graven Mass Talisman, which increases your spell damage by 8%. So, it's a stronger version of the um, the Talisman that you get in the Rare Lucar Academy. If I said Graven, I meant to say Graven Mask. Uh, Graven Mask. Graven Mask Talisman. Um, obviously, from the previous episode... Oh wow, my controller is actually off. Excuse me. Um, we obviously finished at the Inner Consecrated Snowfield, and we're going to do this as its own little video, just so that people can find it if they want it. Um, now, to get into here, you are going to need to have the Fanged Imp Ashes. This can be chosen as a keepsake at the beginning of the game, but there are only 2,000 runes, and you can purchase them from the merchant that is just here, um, over near the gate of the uh, Rail Lucaria area. Give me one second, I've just got to sort my controller out. Okay, controller issues sorted. Uh, as we were saying, you want to grab the, the Fang Dip Ashes from the Rail Lucaro Academy. Uh, this is, so when you're like coming through the gate, you'll get teleported to the to the main uh, academy gate and you'll follow like the bridge kind of southeast. And you'll come across him after a load of wolves. Once you have that then, you can make your way to the uh, to the snowfield. You can kind of come from wherever you want, but this is just a convenient place for me to, for me to start just to show the actual location of it. And then we can make our way across. Hopefully we'll have no deaths on the way over. It would be ideal. I've gone the wrong way slightly. Let's take a right turn. Excuse me, Rock. I need to get around you. Hopefully you're all still enjoying the series. Or if you're just joining us, hopefully you'll stay for a while. Don't know how you guys are getting on with the game. Gonna get all misty around here. We're not too worried about this at the front. I can't remember if there's a clue. Actually. Oh, I don't think we're actually where I, think, I thought we were. I know not, we're not there yet. We're not there. We're not there. Here we are. Yeah, I don't, I don't think there's a clue here. It's kind of weird. Actually. What we need to do is some of these. And my understanding is the imps have to kill this. So we're just gonna knock it down a little bit, but not kill it. Probably don't want to hit it again, we now need to wait for this to for this to work. I guess that's supposed to be the clue. Oh, they need to. It's winning, damn it. Oh, I still haven't upgraded them. Oh, it's opened in, even though I did it. Okay, I guess maybe you just have to have them fight it. Oh yeah. So that done, we can head on up the ladder. Uh, this is going to give us a significant boost to spell damage, in my opinion. Particularly if you're like uh, going to go full magic, you could you could uh, very much have a very, fairly decent boost to your to your damage output now. If you want to use the two damage um, talismans and the magic clutch talisman, it's kind of risky because you'll be taking more damage and things already hurt enough. But it's all there for us to use now if we want to. Either way, hopefully this is helpful for you guys, and I'll see you all in the next video.